Hey, what's going on everybody? It's Ruby Dragon on here again, and I got a review for you guys today. Because finally, Wave 2 is here. Well, it's been here, it's just I've been trying to get through everything else that I've had and been I've had them on the side to do a review and then I do a couple of videos and then I get real tired and I have to go to work in the next morning. So it's kinda like he got kept gotten put off and everything. So I'm opening him first. I have Nilius and Krakelius as well to open up, as well as today I just went to my GameStop and they had um, Arlos Pegatrix and Chaos and Darkus um, Core Serpentes. I got them as well. So they'll be coming soon as well. Um, I still have, I think, maybe like a couple more things from Wave 1 to review as well. But we're going to go ahead and open this guy up right here. So this is Aquasindius, and he is a knight... Like, like a robotic knight Bakugan. Um, he has like a really cool sword on his one arm and a shield on his second one. On his, well, I guess it's his other arm. I mean, you know, he doesn't have four arms, but I don't know. <laughs> so, obviously here we have the beautiful blue. I love this color blue for the Aquas Bakugan that they have, that the blue and the white blue and the orange, it just works together so well. Um, Aquas Cindius. Here's a nice little picture of the Aquas version of Cindius. He comes with the Helix Core and the Green Fist. Unfortunately, no Magic Shield. That kind of sucks, but... And he has a Complexity Transformation Level of 2. So, let's go in the back of the box here. We, of course, have Aquasindius's picture here. He, of course, comes with one Character Card and one Ability Card. The two cores. He's, like I said, he has a Complex Level of 2. And he does the Baku Leap action, or the Leap, leap Open Baku action. So he rolls on the Baku core, he mani the magnet activates, and he, they do like a little flip. But for him, it's a little different, and I will show you guys why it's different. So down here, they also show the rest of the Wave 2 Ultras. We have Krakelius right here, Ventus Serpentes, Pyrus Garganoid, and Dargus Nilius. Now I have Krakelius and Nilius to open up as well. And they will be on here as soon as they can, as soon as I can get them. <laughs> um, we already have them as soon as I can uh, make the video, pretty much. <clears throat> so let's go ahead and open this guy up a while. I was really excited to get this guy. Um, I had him for probably the longest. I went to my local GameStop, and I just happened because I've heard that uh, Bat Gun was in GameStop, which, which by the way, as you can see right there, is the price tag. He's not, not that price. There we go. He's $9.99 for the Ultras, and it's $6.99 for the Cores. Um, so as I was saying, guys, uh, I went to my local GameStop, and I just happened to <clears throat> see I was in this right there, right in front, and I was like, oh, I need to get him. I was waiting for Sinius to come out, so it really made me really happy to, that he was there, and I was able to pick him up. And uh, But unfortunately, instead of having... Um, Different core of version. Uh, my game stuff only got uh, three ultras in, unfortunately. So three ultras. <clears throat> I was thinking like, well, they might have you know Cindius. They might have um, Nilius or Krakelios. And if they have Nilius, you know, I'll pick them up too, obviously. Um, and of course, the most dreaded part that I hate is open these things up, getting them out of their packaging. There we go. Alright. <clears throat> so as I was saying, um, they had three Ultras. Only problem was they had two Syndiuses and one Ventus Serpentes. So I also just got only one Syndius. <laughs> and I didn't feel like getting the uh, Serpentes. So. Alright guys, here is Syndius in his untransformed form. Like I said, he looks like he's about to, like, pierce somebody, or he's, like, doing, like, one of those dashing strikes, like, towards the camera. That was terrible. There we go. Kind of like that. Like, he's, like, he pushed off, like, in those, like, in the anime where they, like, push off and they come with their sword straight at you. Um, but, yeah. He looks really cool in the nice blue aquas color. Um, and everything. His magnet is right here in his shield, which is really cool for the transformation. Um, let's go to the back recorders here. We have the Green Fist, which gives us plus 3 damage. And the Helix, which gives us plus 500B and minus 1 damage. 
So we're going to go ahead and set those out here to make a, a very, very small hide matrix. We'll put Cynthia to the side over here. That's got the cards. I'm going to do this off camera. Do, 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 do. There we go. And of course we get the Aqua Sinus Ultra card, which he does have 300 B power. And he does 4 damage, which that's pretty cool. Pretty good. And then 1 Frost. So um, that means for their flip, flip abilities, it's cost more, more energy to uh, use them, which is really cool. And then Bubble Net, which does 300, plus 300 B. And you retract your back gun at the end of the turn. Um, okay. Um, that is a rare. Uh, the uh, text up here is embossed, so that is a rare. Alright, so there's the two cards we get there. And let's see if I can fold Cyndius. <laughs> For one thing. Maybe not. <laughs> I should have watched a video on how to fold him first. Did I do it right? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. Oh, wait. Wait, wait. Something's not snapping in. Sorry, guys. I thought I might be able to do this real easily. Apparently not. But when they say these are a little bit more complex to, tra to uh, transform to ball form, they weren't joking. He's probably one of the ones I've actually having having the most trouble with. It's odd. Well, anyway, we don't really need to see his ball form. <laughs> That's embarrassing, isn't it? Not being able to know how to transform your own back again. That's kind of embarrassing. You know, that's actually a good title for this video. The most embarrassing Bakugan video you'll ever see. <laughs> I don't know how to transform a Bakugan, guys. <laughs> Alright, well, let's try this again. We're going to flip that over there. Put his head down. Flip that over. Fold that there. Put that down. See, that's what my problem is. It's right there. It's right here at this piece. It doesn't want to connect into the port, which is really weird. Well, I'll have to go watch the video then about how to fold him up. And then, hopefully one day, if I'll be able to use him in a battle. Um, my wife says she wants to battle me sometimes, so hopefully I'll get some battle videos in here. And, oops, I moved my camera somehow. Didn't even know I did that. Like I said... Most embarrassing Bakugan video ever. Let's just go with that. All right, you guys. If you like this video, make sure to leave a like and a comment. And also subscribe to my channel for more epic Bakugan content and more content on things that I personally enjoy. I will see you guys in the next video. Have a good night.